Hello, hello, good evening. Good evening, Gilberto. Good evening, teacher. I see Rodrigo is here as a listener, Maria Leticia, also, and Roberto. I'm in the, in the supermarket, teacher. I will arrive to my home about 25 minutes. Okay, okay. Please bring us something from the supermarket. Oh, yeah, Coca-Cola. Always. <laughs> No, Coca-Cola, no. <laughs> it's... Pepsi then. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> Hello, Andres. Good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you, teacher? No, sorry, I, <laughs> I eat a little. <laughs> are you having dinner? Yes, teacher, but I... I... I almost finished, but how okay. was your day, teacher? How was my day? Mm. Well, yes, <laughs> a little busy, very busy. <laughs> Not a little, <laughs> very busy. Yes. Um, I went to visit three schools, well, here in San Salvador. Um, then I came home and I had to work on something. I was taking a course, uh, well, a certification uh, to teach at the university because now the MINEL wants everybody who teaches at the university to have a certification. So I needed to finish that course today <laughs> because today is the deadline. So yes, I've been working. How about you? Well. I think that it's good teacher for today. I don't have, I know uh, a lot of jobs, a little, but for if anyone receive his, their payment from the bank hypothecario, I don't know if someone knows that the bank hypothecario right now have some problems to pay from really? the, yeah, yeah. You can, you can, I don't know how can I say, Retirar del cajero. Ah, withdraw. 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 Yes. Actually, we, 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 I remember like the first week we, we had class. We used this word, withdraw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I remember. So if uh -huh. I want to say, I want to withdraw my money from the, uh huh. Yes. One day. Yeah. Okay. The ATM. The ATM. Yes. ATM. Right now, this bank has problems. If someone can wants to to withdraw the money. Oh really? So you need to go to the to the yeah, bank, teacher. right? You need to go it's, to uh, the bank. It's for all the country. It's for all the country right now. It's not for yes, the. Yes, I mean. They cannot do it from the ATM, but they can do it from the bank. Like if they go to the bank. Yeah, yeah we can go from, from the bank. Ah, yes, teacher. Okay. I think I think that yes. <laughs> wow. Yes. Wow. That's a big problem then. I think yeah. must, I think my husband gets well, I don't know if right now he gets paid by by the bank that bank. Oh, no, no, no. He gets paid through the Banco de Fomento Agropecuario. It's different. But the, what I don't like is that they don't have enough ATMs. Like, they only have, like, very few. So, well, I hope people were able to, to get their money today because it's payday. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yes, in for not possible tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tomorrow. Okay. 
Well, let's see who else is here. Jose Israel, hello. Good evening to everyone. Good evening. Are you having dinner? No, I want, well, yes, I'm I'm eating a, an apple. Ah, okay. And that's all. <laughs> so you want to keep the doctor away, right? Did you, did yeah, you know that? Do you know yeah, what I'm saying? <laughs> yes, one apple a day keeps man maintain the doctor away. I don't remember. Yes, uh -huh. an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see. We have lady. Hello, lady. Hi, teacher. Hi. Sophia is here. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening, Danny. Welcome. Okay, well, let's see. Um, we have a few of you. I think, let me see who reported that they will not be here today. Let me check. Mm, ah, okay, Rolando is going to be a listener. Uh, let's see. Okay, well, I'm going to check attendance now and then we're going to start, okay? So let me open the file here. Okay, so we have Danny Anthony, Siwenza Ventura. Thank you. Gilberto Benito Santa Maria Rios. Present teacher. Jose Andres Martinez Perez. Present teacher. Jose Israel Martinez Rodriguez. Present teacher. I haven't realized you two have the same last name. Well, it's a very popular last name, right? Martinez. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Almost half half El Salvador has <laughs> Martinez. <laughs> we have a lot of big family teacher in the country. <laughs> yes. Okay. Julio Aristides Paz Rivas. Not here yet. Um, Lady Joana Hernandez Ventura. Present. Um, Luis Rodrigo Morales Ortiz. Here. He's at the supermarket and he promised he will bring us Pepsi. Okay. So Pepsi and con la champán. Okay. So so you choose. Well, right? you, you can choose Pepsi. Well, you need to come to my home. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's see, Maria Leticia, Lalejeño Gonzalez. Thank you, I saw your present. Uh, Mauricio de Jesus Buruca. Mauricio, not here yet. Um, Rebecca Maria Cardona Juarez. I think she's not going to be here today. As far as I remember, Roberto Carlos Sanchez Al. Sorry, I'm sorry. Roberto Carlos Gámez Alvarenga. Present teacher. I'm changing your last okay, name. My last name. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> okay. It's because I have Rolando uh, next to you. Rolando Danilo Sánchez Arteaga. Rolando, you're a listener. Okay. Uh, Sofía Karina Crespo Martínez. Okay, listener, and Yesenia Gabriela Aguilar Granadeño. Mm, for a moment, I saw her, but I think she's not here right now. Okay, well, there we are. Um, now, what are we doing today? Well, um, yesterday you created some conversations and we only had the chance to listen to Rodrigo and Roberto. Okay, so if you have your presentation ready, your conversation ready, uh, I will give you 
some time for you to share, okay? So right now I'm taking volunteers. Hello, Rebecca, welcome. We just passed attendance, but I see you're here. Um, okay, okay, thank you. So um, let's see, lady, you wanna share your conversation? Go ahead. Teacher, but uh, Rolando. Mm. Yes, Rolando is a listener. Um, if you have it written, somebody else can help you read his part. Okay. Okay. Can you see? Yes. Okay, so who who would like to to participate here with Lady? Someone? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Roberto. Thank you, Roberto. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay, I, I start. I am Rolando. Hello, lady. How are you? Hi, Roberto. I am fine. I want to know if you go to the gym. I don't, but I know many friends who... Oh, no, 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 Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I remember this was the previous one. Uh -huh. I was going to ask the same. Sorry. Don't worry. En lo que la busco, no sé si alguien más puede participar, mi. Okay, okay. Please. Let's see. Who else? Okay, Andres. Great. Go ahead. Andres and, and Danny, right? Yes, teacher. I don't know if Danny is <laughs> sorry. He is ready. Are you ready, Danny? Um, Andres, you have a uh, screenshot. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to show right now. Okay, yeah. okay. great. I don't know if if it is good. Uh, anyone, everybody can see. Yes, I can. I can see it. I think you can yeah. see. Can you see, uh, Dan, Danny? Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 Andrea. Okay, okay. So, good night, everyone. So we are going to start. Mm -hmm. Hello, Danny. Good night. Hello, Andres. Good night. How are how are these sales of Voyager in your company? The sales are ex because right now we have more new clients, but I don't know if we are going to have enough products like bullets for we can bring more security service. Oh, so I can understand. You, do, you don't have enough budget for bring security service, but I have the solution. I have the phone number or a supply or a supply from Brazil. A specific is located in Rio de Janeiro. This play has enough budget for can provide an army. Are you interested? Yes, please. Bring me the phone number. I don't I don't care about the money. I just need enough bullet for I can bring the security service for the new water down from El Salvador. Thank you, Danny. Oh. Okay, it's uh, uh, that's it, teacher. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you. Everyone, clap for Danny and Andres. Very good. Okay. Oh, can you can you please keep sharing? I just want to focus on your use of the structure that we were practicing. So can you share again, please? Yes, yes, teacher. I'm going to share. Oh, he's here. He's there. Okay. Uh, let's see. For example, you say 
we are going to have, I don't know if we are going to have enough products like bullet, bullets. Uh-huh, okay, very good. So that's an example where we are using enough. Then in Danny's part, he also mentions, I understand that you don't have enough bullets. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. Okay, uh, since you have the conversation written, I'm also going to give you some feedback in terms of um, some grammar things that I see. Uh, okay. Let's see. Um, okay, for example, in the last part uh, for Andres, is it says, if we are going to have enough products, like bullets for we can bring more security services. I think in that case, we can say for us to bring, for us to bring, because the idea I think in, in Spanish is para que podamos brindar o traer, bring es traer, so para que podamos traer, Entonces sería... No, en, en esa parte sería como para que podamos brindar, teacher. Ah, ok, ok. So, in this case, ah. we, we need a different word. Instead of bring, we can say, so we can provide. 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 So, we can provide. Entonces, en vez del so, usamos... I'm sorry, instead of score, ah, we use so. Yeah, yeah. So, we can provide... Let me uh, provide. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, okay. So we can provide more security service. Uh huh. Yes. Let okay. me see. Uh, and then in the other part, Danny's part, it would be the same, right? We have, you don't have enough bullets to provide security services. To provide. Provide to provide. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. This place has enough bullets. Okay. And here also at the end, you say we can also say to provide an army. To provide, or we can also add the preposition for to provide for an army. We have in, the place has enough bullets to provide for an army. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay, very good. Um and the pronunciation, remember uh, Danny is bullets. 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 Mm -hmm. Bullets. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Let's see, now we have a um, lady, are you ready? Yes. Okay. So, uh, Roberto, will you be the participant? Yes, I'm ready. Great. Are you ready, lady? Yes. Okay. It's the correct presentation, right? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> no. Sorry. I, I'm oh kidding. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Like mother lady. Okay. <laughs> okay, I start. I am Rolando. Hello, lady. Hi, Rolando. What do you do? I made the inventory of supplies. And for what? Can you explain, please? Our company cannot be left without supplies to create the products we offer to our, our public. So we are today doing this type of activities. What happens if they run out of the supply? We mainly lose customers because we will not be able to meet their needs in time. I understand. So we have to have everything up to date. I am very interested to know more about it, about that. Can you explain me later? Yes, maybe tomorrow because 
uh, I am sleeping. <laughs> yeah, see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, <laughs> thank you, lady. Bye bye. So you are, you are sleeping, but you are speaking, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that is a that is a new ability. It's a new skill, right? Yes. To, to be Con able... abierto y el otro cerrado. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, great. Um, okay, let's clap for lady and... Um, Roberto and also Rolando because he he participated yesterday creating the conversation. Okay, uh, what I saw, what I was checking is that uh, there was no example of enough. So probably we can like there are I I saw some expressions where you could add uh, that 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 phrase right to practice enough plus a noun. Also, I like in a, well, I saw a verb that probably, I don't know if everybody is familiar with, I'm going to write it in the chat. And it is, it, it is related to what we are talking about in this type of conversation. Remember uh, the task was to talk about uh, those times when we lack products, right? When we lack supplies. So uh, in ladies' conversation, I saw this, this verb, run out of. What do you do when you run out of supplies? So uh, in this case, this is a more sophisticated way to say that you are lacking something, right? Because you run out of something. So it's a synonym, basically. But it's a, um, we call them Phrasal verb, okay? It's so, an advanced phrase. Exactly. <laughs> okay. It's a sophisticated verb, um, phrasal verb, okay? So it's a synonym of lack, which means that you don't have something, right? Uh, yesterday I, I gave you the, the, the explanation for lack, and so it's a synonym, okay? Run out of. Okay, very good. Let's see now if we have missed, if we are missing someone who wants to share. Oh, I think Gilberto and Israel, right? Yes, teacher, share the chat. Okay, yes, let me, let me open. Okay, let's see. Okay, here we are. Israel starts. Uh, good evening to everyone. And we are going to start with our dialogue. And Hello, Gilberto. Can you tell me what product distributed in the company you work for? Yes, sure. In my company, we distribute and now products like garlic, paper, pepper, cinnamon, rinses, and nomex. And those products, where you sell them? Or who are you selling to? Uh, the consumer, the customer, a restaurant and supermarket. I have demands and now in the other consumer. What do they do to avoid being left without a product like, like garlic? In that case, the company purchased and now product two, two months in advance. Okay. Bravo. Clap for Gilberto and Israel, please. Great. Okay. Um, yes, Israel? 
No, it's supposed to be a club. <laughs> no, that is, you raise your hand. <laughs> yes. You missed the, the reaction. Okay, let's see. Um, Before I, I, I stop sharing, I want to check the examples that you used with enough. So here, for example, we have in my company, we distribute enough products. Okay, so we have enough plus the noun product, right? Then uh, let's see in the second, we have a second example here. If we say um, the customers are restaurants and supermarkets, I have demands enough. Um, in this case, it would be the same um, structure, right? So we say, I have enough demand. Enough demand. Uh huh. Okay. Demand is is an is a non countable noun. So so we don't add the s. We only say demand. I have enough demand. Uh, and then, um, well, I'm not sure here what you what you mean. ¿Qué, quis, qué quisieron decir aquí en esta parte? Eh, que hay otros clientes interesados, que, que no necesariamente supermarket o restaurant. Okay. So, customers are restaurants and supermarkets. Okay, here I think you need because you are like making a contrast porque estamos hablando de que no solo ellos entonces sería but I also ah. have okay, but I also have enough demand from from other customers from other customers Okay. But I also have enough demand from other cost consumers. Consumers? Oh, yes. cost consumers. Okay. Okay, very good. Uh let's see what do they do to avoid being left out or being left without a product like garlic. This is another expression that is a synonym of like run out. Uh I mean they don't exactly mean the same, but they have a similar meaning, okay? So being left without is another expression, okay? Being left without. Um, okay, and then in the last part, in that case, the company purchases enough products, okay? We have another example here. Enough products two months in advance, okay? Okay, so thank you. I think we covered everybody. Everybody participated. So let's start. Okay, great. So now we're going to move to our manual. Let me share the manual. Okay, we have this vocabulary, but we already checked the vocabulary. Remember we did that um, when we were reading the article about promotion strategies. So advertising, personal sales, sales promotion, sponsor, public relations. Maybe just to refresh our mind about these concepts, we can do the matching, okay? So we're going to do the matching just to check. So we're going to do it together, okay? Um, let's see. Okay, so let's start with promotions designed to create a short-term increase in sales. What are those? Designed to create a short-term increase in sales. Could be sales promotion. 
Okay, sales promotion, number three, right? Okay, let's now see the next one. Building a positive relationship between the organization, the media, and the public. Public relation, number five. Okay, number five, public relations. Mm -hmm. uh, next, sales interaction between the films, sorry, the firm's representative and a consumer on a one to one basis. Uh, the personal sales. sales. Okay, personal sales, so that is number two, right? Number two. Mm -hmm. um, let's see next, a form of marketing that employs an openly sponsored message to promote or sell a product. Number one, are visiting. Okay, advertising. Advertising. Advertising, uh huh. And the last one, a person or organization that provides funds for an activity carried out by another. This would be number four, right? Number four, a sponsor. Okay. So let's see, number three, promotions designed to create a short-term increase in sales. Okay, correct. And number next, building a positive relationship is public relations. Uh -huh. A sales interaction between the firm's representative and a consumer on a one-to-one, -one, meaning in personal or individual, right? One-to-one one -one is personal or individual. So definitely is number two, personal sales. In the next one, a form of marketing that employs an openly sponsored message to promote or sell a product, advertising, okay? And the last one, sponsor. Okay, so again, uh, this vocabulary, we checked it in the article that we read, okay? Great. So now we're going to continue with, um, oh, and this is what we already did, like the, the, the conversation that we checked for promotion yesterday, we did that. So the, the self-assessment uh, is about that, okay? Uh, I can analyze the place and promotion strategies of a famous national product or service. So can you do it independently? with occasional help or only with help, okay? So just take a few seconds to analyze that. Okay, in the meantime, I'm going to delete this. Okay, now that we are done with our self-assessment, we are going to um, continue here with our uh, unit two, the material in the manual. And in this case, uh, the objective is to describe the achievements of effective branding for the company, okay? And we start with these questions. First of all, why is a marketing plan important? Let me see. I'm going to ask this question directly to one of you. Let's listen to Israel. Why do you think a marketing plan is important? Uh, repeat the question, please. 
why is a marketing plan important? Ah, well, um, you have to do a structure of your product that you want to show to the public. So you have to put, uh, um, you have to do that step by step to to do the marketing. <laughs> Mm -hmm. something like that <laughs> something like that okay good um now let's see the second question will be for lady okay lady the second question what kind of details would you include in your marketing plan Technological. Mm -hmm. mm. No se me ocurre que otro. Okay. Don't worry. We're going to check that in the rest of the lesson. Okay. Um, well, in number two, we have a definition, okay, about what is a marketing plan. So let me see. Danny, can you help me read the definition for a marketing plan, please? Okay, teacher. Uh, the marketing plan is a written record of how you're going to use your marketing mix. Look at the basics of a marketing plan below. Read the equation and the level each of a part with the four PS. Okay, thank you. So, okay, what is a marketing plan? A written record of how you're going to use your marketing mix. And what is the marketing mix? Well, we have been talking about it for the past two weeks, I think. Um, so we have the, the four Ps, right? Placement, price, promotion, and product or service, okay? So basically the marketing plan will be um, like a list of activities that you will develop regarding these four Ps, regarding these four elements, right? Okay, so now um, we have the Ps, the four Ps, and here in this um, little exercise, we are going to be like matching, okay? Or completing. So we have, um, like a, a, a short description of what that element is about, okay? And also there are some questions, okay? These questions are the ones that we need to answer when creating our marketing plan, okay? So first, let's look at letter A, okay? Um, let me see. Let's see, Gilberto. Gilberto, let's read uh, this part, please. Number one. Okay. You get a gig to products a new brand. May wax, may do you choose? Okay. So you get to give the product a new brand name. What name do you choose? And also, the second question, please. What does your product do? Okay. Mm -hmm. So these two questions um, are discussing what, what kind of P, placement, price, promotion, or product or service. Mm -hmm. I see teacher and uh, the price 
It's very important and new products in the place. Uh -huh. And in the quality. Yeah? Yes. But okay, but the exercise, the, the, what we are doing here, Gilberto, is labeling. Okay, so you need to read the questions and match if the questions, for example, are these questions related to placement? Are they related to price? Are they related to promotion or to the product or service? What do you think? Product service. Product service, okay. So these questions are about product. Product service. Okay. Now let's look at letter B. Okay, we have also two questions. Uh, let's see, Jose Andres, can you read the questions for letter B, please? Yes. How much does your product cost? Will you see any special price strategies, coupons, salsa bands, etc.? If so, which strategies and why? Okay, so these questions are related to price. 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 Okay, very good. Price. So let's write price here. Okay. Let's continue. Letter C. Okay, let us see. Okay, let us see. Um, let me see who's going to read. Julio. Mauricio, are you participating, Mauricio? Maybe not. Let me see. Rodrigo, are you back? Rodrigo? Okay, what about Sophia? Hello, teacher. Hello. I just arrived in my home right now. Okay, okay. Well, um, can you help me read this part, please? Let us see. Uh, yeah, well, where where will you sell your product? Mm -hmm. Retail, online, etc. Mm -hmm. And you need the answer. No, no, no. Just the question. We have another. Uh, where will where will your uh, where will you position your product to catch the eye on your target customer? Top shelf. But busy street corner, etc. Aha. Uh -huh. So now we need to decide which of the four P's these uh, questions belong to: placement, price, promotion, or product or service. Placement. Okay. Okay. Placement. Thank you. Okay, and the last one, let's see. Okay, give me a second because everything is moving. Todo se me movió ya.
The problem is that I cannot move these things. Let me see. Okay, well, uh, let's see the last one, letter D. Um, Danny, are you there? Okay, teacher. Um, wait, wait, wait. Yes, I'm okay. How would you advertise the product? Um, who is your target customer? Who is your target customer? Uh -huh. This would be for... Promotion. Um, P, P for promotion. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now that we already have identified the questions, Okay, these are the questions that we're going to answer when we are creating our marketing plan, right? So, for example, uh, I have, okay, my product is, um, let's see, an online English course, okay? An online English course for, um, let me see, for, how do you call this? Fly attendants, okay? An online English course for fly attendants. That is my product, okay? So, um, I answered the question. Um, first, I need to give it a name, right? Well, in this case, um, I need to think of a creative name for my course. Um, maybe I can say fly higher with an English course with a with an English course created just for you. I don't know, something like that. Fly higher first, something like that. Okay, and then what does your product do? Ah, here I will explain that it is a course especially created for fly attendants because it focuses on um, the vocabulary they will be using while uh, on the plane, of course, uh, expressions that are related to what they will talk to the, to the customers and also vocabulary that is related to um, the different parts of the plane, etc. right? So that is what my product does, okay? Something that is specifically created for the needs of flight attendants. Okay, now let's uh, see the next questions which are related, are related to price. How much does your product cost? Well, in my case, uh, my product will cost um, a hundred dollars. It's a, um, let me see, it's a 30 hour course for a hundred dollar. It's very affordable, okay? <laughs> then uh, will you use any special price strategies like coupons, sales events? In this case, I will use, um, I, Let's say if you register in the next 24 hours, you can get a 15% discount, okay? So everybody who registers or who enrolls in the course uh, for the next 24 hours will get a 15% discount. Okay, so that's my special price strategy. Now, uh, in letter C, we have placement, right? Where will I sell my product? In this case, I will sell it online um, in a platform that is in charge of promoting different courses online, okay? Uh, where will I position my product to catch the eye of my target customer? 
Well, uh, I will be posting, I will pay for ads, Google ads, and uh, social media ads, like on Facebook, for example, and YouTube. Um, I will pay for those ads as well on Facebook and YouTube. Um, Oh, no, I'm sorry. This is for, let me see, where will you position your product to catch the eye? This is not about promotion. This is about place. I'm sorry. In the case of placement, um, well, I said that I will I will uh, store it in a platform where they sell different types of courses. Uh, they can sell courses about technology, courses about languages, courses about um crafts different types of courses online so uh, this platform that i will use has a uh, different types of courses and one of them is a course like in this case language courses that are specific for a group of people or a group of professionals okay and lastly the promotion part how would you advertise the product? Well, I was saying that I will use Google ads uh, or a, a ads in social media like Facebook and YouTube. Uh, who is my target customer? Well, I have a very specific target customer. Uh, is fly attendants uh, who are, well, we can say fly attendants who are just um, starting their career or people who are training to be flight attendants in the future okay um so that's my marketing plan okay i wanted to give you an example by answering all the questions you see here okay so now is your turn okay now that you have an example Give me one second here. Vamos a subir un poco. Okay, so here you have the task. But first, I would like to check if everything is clear uh, in terms of the questions. Is everything clear about the questions? Yes, teacher. Okay, permítanme, voy a borrar esto. Okay, so all the questions are clear. Uh, we already know what they are about. Letter A is product or service. Letter B is price. Letter C is a placement. And letter D is promotion, right? Okay, so what is our task here in number three? We're going to choose a product or service that you use every week, okay? And then we're going to create a marketing plan for this product using the questions above, okay? So the previous questions that I already gave you an example for are, are our guide. Okay, um, so we're going to have some time to work uh, in pairs in order to create this marketing plan, okay? First, you choose a product that you use every week. Um, I don't know, for example, a, um, how do you call it? A shaving machine could be, or... Um, Let's see, um, detergent, like to wash your, your to, do, to do your laundry. Um, maybe, uh, let's see, another product. Um, the food. The what? Can you repeat, please? Hello? 
Alguien dijo algo, pero no entendí. Uh, the food. Food, de comida, ah, food. <laughs> okay, the food, yes. Exactly. <laughs> food. But food, yeah, it's food. food. I know, I know. I thought you were saying food, and I was like, hmm, how come? Okay, but food. food. Ah? Uh, how, how, how do you say? I'm not sure if you are saying food or something else. What is the word? Is it food? F O F O O D? Food? Yes. Ah, okay. But in the case of food, well, you have different types. Mm -hmm. So you need to um, probably, I don't know, maybe eggs or chicken meat or cheese or tortillas. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. okay. okay. So you need to choose a specific kind mm -hmm. oh, because we're talking about specific products mm -hmm. okay um so yes first choose the product or service and then develop the marketing plan using the questions okay so let's uh, start checking the groups mm, let's see Today there are like half of you as listeners. So let me check if we have enough people for four rooms. Okay, Danny and Hilbert. Then Okay, we are ready. Um, there will be a group of three because because of the people who are listeners, I don't have enough um to make pairs. Okay, enough people to make pairs. So there will be a group of three. Okay. Okay. So well, I think maybe we can do the or like create the marketing plan probably in around 10 minutes. Okay, so that's the time I'm going to provide and then I'm going to be checking how every group is doing, okay? So I'll see you in your rooms with your classmates.
Uy, no se ve la primera. <risa> It's better. Do you, do you need me to share the, the questions? Uh, yes, teacher. Please. Okay. Let's have him. Okay, I'm going to share it in the WhatsApp group so everybody can access it. Because I guess there will be other people who don't have it. Okay, there you have it. <clears throat> I don't Israel. We have to first uh, the choose the product. No, <laughs> Ay, no. Yo el sinónimo de proteger el cuerpo. <laughs> Bad and body. Así se escribe, ¿ve? Body wash. wash. Vaya, yo pensé que era de eso. En body, ah, body works. Ah, okay. Es una marca de body crema. Wash. <laughs> you are getting confused <laughs> with body work, bodyguards, and body, body works. Es que, yeah. es que él dijo que ya sabía de qué y dijo, ah, de, y dijo la mención, ah, le digo yo una crema, le digo, una marca de crema. Yeah. Me dice yeah. no. <risa> <risa> okay. así, se, así se hacen los chambres, dígale, Andrés. <risa> right? <risa> If you don't pronounce something well or somebody doesn't understand it, yes. Yes. So because the sounds of some words are similar. That's right. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you gotta okay. be careful. In this case, it's is 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 fine. It's is, but there are some other words that you have the normal word, let's say, and then you have a bad word, right? So it's it's kind of. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, lady, I don't know if you want to talk about the body wars or the body wars. <laughs> you pensé que era ese. No, pero de qué hablaríamos? The body wars. Hablamos mejor de la crema para el cuerpo. No, 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 está bien eso. Okay, entonces le pondríamos, yo creo que este. O sea, ya es algo prim. Ajá. Ok. Ajá, entonces vamos a hablar acerca de un café. Uh -huh, entonces, yo... la primera quiero ver. You, you have to give a product, a new brand name. What name do you choose? 
Eh, vaya, el, el name, the name will be, could be. Mm, sí. Ata Coffee, va. Ata Coffee, va. Va, ok. Ya voy a registrar el nombre, tal vez gano dinero. <risa> ok. Nuestro café se va a llamar Ata Coffee. Hoy sí. Es muy creativo. Es muy creativo. Teacher, I have my ultimates, uh, ne neurons, neuronas, neurons, right? Yes, neurons, neurons. Uh, neurons, I have my ultimate neurons, so <laughs> it will be very useful. <laughs> you are not the only one, Rodrigo. <laughs> mm, believe me, I am, I am the only one right now because I, I am not in my computer today. I don't want it. Ah, today yeah. the, the morning was very mm -hmm. heavy today because I have many reunions with a provider from Italy. So, mm -hmm. uh, and the person is very um, terco. Stubborn. Stubborn. Mm -hmm. Stubborn, uh -huh, right. Stubborn, so Stubborn. very, very tired of that. Mm, stressing. In what language mm, do you very use? Stress. What no, language? English. Yeah. This Italian, this Italian contact he lives in Brazil, but is is it an Italian? He is no, no. Sorry, he speaks uh, Spanish. Oh, uh, okay. Also speak English, but uh, he speaks the Spanish very well. But sometimes. He, he, he doesn't understand at all, or maybe you, you need to repeat one, two, three times the same thing because it's a stubborn people. Okay. Uh, and it, it is very stressing. Yeah, yeah, I imagine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, uh, Robert, well, uh, in, in, a two, in, in, in the two, what does your product do? Uh, well, it's it's a El otro, ya ese el otro, eh, dice, dice de Ortega, eh, eh, tema, uh, letter B, price, okay. how much does your product cost? Mm -hmm. How much does your product cost? Uh, in the case, three dollar for pence. Three dollars for Per unit or three dollar for one for, pound. Uh, uh, one pound. And, and this comes. Uh, cool. Cool. For sale. Uh, el galón físico trae ocho libras, no? Ya. Uh, el galón de qué? De, de hongos. Sí, eso viene en galones. Viene, Yo viene por libra, libra. Es que sí, se vende por libra, pero viene en líquido, viene en líquido, preservante, ¿verdad? Ah. Cuando usted lo compra, se le, le pesan la libra, ¿verdad? Pero si usted compra el, el galoncito, ya es otro precio más cómodo, ¿verdad? O sea que ahí sí podríamos incluir en un discount por la compra del galón, ¿verdad? Ahí entonces en, en, en la Praia Estrategia. Yes. Ahí está, está. Ah. You are talking about gives discount to the client. Ajá, uh -huh, discount to the client. Ajá. Uh -huh.
Entonces, de de Treasure de Answer is the use the Va, dice, uh, which strategy y por qué? Dice, uh, go, why use uh, price strategy de discount? Person, dollar. Per, per person, per teacher. teacher. Teacher is correct if we want to say per person. Yes, per person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Per. Yes. Per. Mm-hmm. Per person. Okay, okay teacher. It's per product, product, but product. It's, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Y aquí podría ser the price. The price or product goes. Así. Of our product, the price of our product is, ya nos haría otra vez, cost. Is. 700 dollars per person. Yes. Okay. Y la otra sería, will you use any special price strategies? Es la, la pregunta cuatro, ¿verdad? Will. You, sí, es la pregunta cuatro. Exacto. Any special special price strategies. No oh, sé. Sí. Bueno, Estoy anotando las preguntas para después responderlas. Sí, perdón que me, por rato me cae el lindo. <ríe> Yo estoy confiada que usted sabe del producto. <ríe> no, no, eso sí. <ríe> eso sí. Ok. Decision, your product. Your product. Cash. The cash. The Andrés. Sí, perdón, estoy escribiendo aquí en el en el chat. Ok. Vaya, este, will you see any special price strategies? Ahí sería que si usaríamos alguna estrategia especial para de estrategia, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Entonces ahí lo puse yo. If you hire a contract with us today, yo creo que es que significa. 
If you hire a contract with EOS today, you don't pay, you are going to have a dis discount of 100? Of 100, see. Do you mean that they will get free service? And yeah, then, does perdón. that <laughs> perdón, perdón. Yes. does it mean that if somebody if somebody gets your service today they will not pay for anything they will have free service no 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 no, no teacher <laughs> it's like eh, como que se les contaría 100 dólares Ah, okay, okay. I thought you were saying that you will have a 100 discount, 100% 100 discount. Okay, in this case, maybe, well, ah, but you already mentioned that is 700, right? So if you hire a yeah. contract with us today, um, you don't pay, you don't pay ah, no, the okay. full amount. You don't pay the full, Ajá, eso, eso the full amount. You don't pay seven. Mm -hmm. So it would be you don't pay full full fee. Okay, you don't pay full fee. You're going to you're going to have a discount of a hundred dollars. But maybe it's better if you put it into percentage. So if we say, if we say, okay, 700. Let me see. I think it's about 15%. Let me check. Uh huh. $105 is 15%. I'm sorry, I have some problem with my internet. Okay. Seven hundred here. Aha. Uh -huh. If you discount a hundred dollars out of out of seven hundred, that makes about fourteen percent. So let's say that probably you're talking about a 15% discount. If you if you get the service today. Oh. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is another if way to say your... para que no se para que no sea como confuso, mejor ponerlo en yeah. Por, per, eh, ¿Cómo se dice? Porcentaje, percentage. Que no se van a descontar 100 dólares, sino que un porcentaje. Que podría ser como quizás 7%. Uh -huh. No, el 15. Bueno, 15 si, son, si son 100 dólares, aproximadamente sale como. Eh, ajá, si, digamos, si es el 15, son 105 dólares de 700. Si son, si es el 10%, por ejemplo, ahí ya sería menos, menos de 100 dólares. 70 dólares serían. But okay. I let you decide, ¿ok? 10%. <laughs> you don't want to give a, a, a higher discount. Well, because the price is, I mean, it's not like you're buying a, a pair of shoes or something, right? The, the product or the service is, yeah. is a little bit more, the price is higher, right? So I guess. It's almost like you say that you, you try to buy a, a life from a life for a life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You try to buy. Yeah. Some life. Some, some life, yes. Extra life. Extra life, yeah. Have you have you been a, a like I understand Andres, you have a, a an administrative position right now, but were you did you work as a bodyguard at some point? No. 
No. No, teacher. I receive different um, capacitations from like that, but I don't. I never work like that. Ah, okay, okay. I know how can you how can manipulate or use a weapon. Yeah, of course, but uh -huh. um, doing the, the 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 job, the really job. No, never. Ah, okay. I see. Okay. Well, so... let me check on your classmates, and probably we'll be back to the main room in like three minutes. No. You need more time? <laughs> yes. Okay, let me check yeah. how the others are doing, okay? The customer. I seen the restaurant and in supermarket, those target very important for sale. Advertising billboards. Danny, I sent you how uh -huh. to say bias publicitarias, advertising billboards. Advertising billboards. Advertising billboards. By uh -huh. advertising billboards in the in the principal strip in the country in the in the center the the our city in the huh? could be in the, in the center of the city or in the most crowded areas of the city the most crowded uh, crowded is uh Congestionado. Como llena, digámosles. Uh -huh. Crowder. Ok. Um, is, is very good uh, marketing strategy for the promotion of, of product. Strategic locations, strategic locations, strategic location. Mm -hmm. Okay, Vaya. eso nada más. Mm -hmm. Es como te has fijado en los pronto a dónde tienen el café. Sí, sí, un, un, un mueblecito totalmente bien personalizado, solo para que lo veas. Ajá, <risa> ok. Um, la número. La... Leder, Leder D. Ya vi. Me acaban de venir a enseñar un vaca negra que no me voy a comer. Bueno. <risa> vale, entonces yo creo que ahí se va, Robert. Va. Y por último va el promotion. Ok, promotion. Aquí van a comer vaca negra y un plátano sudado. <risa> Buena combinación para la dieta. Qué, qué triste. No, pero me comí unos honguitos ahí, entonces ya son placeres de los pobres. Ok. No, son buenos los hongos con contagín, se los recomiendo. Y trompe. ¿Estás una diet, Rodrigo? Eh, actually, teacher, when I start. The, this English mm, trying to make diet because in the past I tried to make some exercise but I don't have the time right now okay. and I gained some pounds right now so mm. I need to do something actually maybe not diet, diet but trying to not eat much uh, bread okay. and tortillas I see but, but uh, it is very difficult because I'm very, uh, <clears throat> I have my 
eh, ¿qué? Costumbre. I am used to. I am used to. I am used to. I am, I am used, to, used to eating. I am used to, to eat not maybe very much, but to get satisfied. <laughs> but but in my real case and try to not uh, leave the English. Mm -hmm. That is my only my only way to make some diet. Okay. Maybe not not diet, but uh, let's be more careful to, about. Try to eat uh, a little, a little uh, healthy. Healthy, uh, right? Healthy. Okay. Uh huh. But it is difficult. I know. Really. <laughs> okay. Uh, you see in the two questions, right? I'm just checking. Right. Okay. The last two. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, Robert, uh, in the Market, market, and government, 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 government institutions, for explain or service. I got them at you, okay. Uber. Between the different banks, markets, and Ah, uh, sí. Ay, perdón. Oh, sí. Visit the different banks, governmental institutions, markets, como mercado, markets, or companies, mejor en vez de mercado. Creo que es mejor. Companies, institutions, government institutions, or companies. And companies to explain or service. Terms and conditions. Terms and conditions about our service, yes. Ah, uh, see, oh, it sounds. Yes. Who is your target customer? I hate all the questions. <laughs> Teacher, si hay algo que corregir, díganos. <laughs> Cabal, es que Diga como que casi todas las preguntas, casi todas las preguntas se parecen, es como que una casi contesta a la otra y casi son yeah. como lo mismo. Well, let's see. Where will you sell your product? Social media and promotion social events in the country. How uh, will you use any special price strategy? Where is you position your product to catch the eye? Mm. Okay, this these two questions, where will you sell your product and where will you position your product to catch the eye of the target customer? These two are about placement, okay? So they need to be focused on like in this case, let me see. Your product is um. Oh my gosh. Body wear. Body guard. Body guard. Body, body, body guards. Yes. Uh -huh. okay. okay. 
Yes. So, well, if you're going to sell it online, right? You're going to sell it online. So, oh. Online, yeah, online, and visit some customers. Okay. So, um, yeah, the thing is that because these are services, they are not like, you know, for example, when you are selling shoes, right, that you have them in the store and et cetera. So in this case, uh, that's why the, the last four questions are similar. I mean, maybe they seem similar because they, I mean, for example, if you say that you're going to sell uh, the service in social media, uh, and we can say make a page for we can sell our product it's like that exactly uh-huh yes that would be better more specific uh-huh uh, make a page to um, make a web page to uh-huh for for customers to um to purchase the product the, the service, right? So they have like, probably they will see different choices. Like if I want to ha hire someone for a day, hire someone, like the different packages, they can see like the different packages for your service and they can choose. Mm -hmm. And then the last two questions are about promotion. Right, which in this case, yes, it applies to, um, well, I don't know, I guess when you say visit different banks, this would be more like personal selling or let me see, uh -huh, personal selling. And also, oh. Uh-huh. So visit when you visit the banks, the government institutions, etc., that is what you're doing. You're doing personal selling. Or it could also be public relations, right? Public relations. Especially with your kind of with your service, because this is about establishing good relationships. I think because it's a, it's a service that is about taking care of other people. Uh, yes. It is very important that you have very good relationships with your clients. Because yes. if, if you have a good relationship, they can trust you. And trust is a very important aspect in this kind of service, I think. Yes, teacher, of course, yes. Mm -hmm. So we are going to change from the where will you position your product to catch the eye of your target customer no no other where will you sell your product yeah, so we are going to say change for make a wall page for customer can purchase your product uh-huh yes and then where will you position it um because your target customer is basically uh, these type of companies, banks, government institutions, et cetera, then probably uh, you can, um, you can say that you will make this website, the website for purchasing the, the, the service, you will make it available to, to your your target customers, right? Probably through email, maybe uh, sending the the website link through email to your possible clients. Also, um, it could be. Um, let me see probably is a sponsoring no, but that is promotion you are right yes. these last four questions okay. or at least the the number this one the the number 
I don't remember what number it is, but this one about what will you position and how will you advertise is similar because in this case, we're talking about a service that you will probably sell online, so. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, okay, teacher. So when we talk about where, where will your position your product to cast the eye for your target customer, we can say that we, we are going to share the link from the customer, the different customer of our website, where mm -hmm. they can see the different kind of product that our company, or yeah, that, that's our company have. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. And the other one, how will you advertise the product? Personal, well, like you say, personal selling? Uh-huh. I mean, the answer you, you already have is okay. Uh, what I was just okay. saying is that this is about personal selling. When you visit, it's personal selling. So you can say through personal selling, for example, visit different banks, government institutions, and companies like that. O sea, dejar okay. eso mismo, solo agregar esa parte. For personal selling. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. okay, we're almost done, right? We are coming back soon. Hello, everyone. I know some of you were ready. I think Gilberto's group was ready, but I was uh, waiting for your classmates who were still working, okay? I was checking. Okay, well, I think we are ready to share our marketing plan. Very good. I want to hear all those marketing plans. Uh, for your products, okay? So we're going to start with Gilberto's group, which I'm sure they are 100% ready, right? Okay, teacher, starting my partner, Israel. Okay. Well, good evening, everyone. We are going to talk about um, our marketing plan. And first of all, I have to explain to all of you our product or the name of our product. And our name, well, we choose uh, the mushroom. It's a product like everyone knows what is a mushroom. We can eat it. And well, normally you can eat it on a pizza. And what does your product do? Well, the product gives uh, uh, another flavor to the food. And about the cost of the product, the cost of the, uh, the average cost of the, of the mushroom could be $3 per pound. And about the special price strategies. We were talking about give discount to all the client who buys more than three or four pounds. Also give them uh, discounts, uh, tickets or 
uh, just tickets of discount for another product of the brand Mushroom, because the, the, the brand is called Mushroom too. Okay. And now uh, my friend, Danny, I think Danny or Gilberto. Uh -huh. Okay, Danny. No, uh, and where will you sell your product? Uh, in we in we case is uh, I we sell our product in very important place is the restaurant. Is uh, is this the place the the more uh, important for the strategy? Uh, is this uh, the the indirect distribution uh, for this? Uh, is a uh, create the contract with the big company uh, how the pizza hat is is a uh, uh, use the mushroom in big uh, in big cone is is a uh, 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 the the first place in our strategy um and where will position your product to catch a your target customer? Is this a uh, at the position is a uh, at top shelf in, in our product? Um, continue, uh, Gilberto. Okay. How will you advertise the products and social media? Advertising, billboard, and the other place, uh, restaurant, hotel, and supermarket, the test, the product, um, and the uh, who who is your target customer is very important for localization the the consumer the product for incre increasing the the sale the product um, only that teacher okay um but I, I still have the question here who is your target customer well because you uh, said that is important but who is your target customer see who's who, who is your target customer? Mm -hmm. uh, is the restaurant. Rest, restaurant, hotel, and supermarket? Ah, okay, okay, yes, good. Very good. In the, mm -hmm. in the restaurant, it is the more important in, in our product. It, it is oh. the it is the use big uh, quantity. In, in the morning, in the lunch, in the dinner. Okay, they use it a lot, right? In different kinds of foods. Okay. Perfect. Okay, great. Thank you. Um, well, I saw that you uh, included some vocabulary that we have been checking, like, for example, indirect distribution, um, also, well, I, I I heard some phrases like advertising billboards. That is a new um, phrase that we, well, maybe not new for everybody, but something that is related to uh, the vocabulary we have been checking, right? Those are like a specific advertising um, ways to promote something. Okay, everybody, give a clap to our first group, Mr. Gilberto, Mr. Israel, and Mr. Danny. Okay, great. Thank you, teacher. Great. Okay, now we're going to 
uh, have our next group of participants. Let's see, we're going to have Mr. Andres and Miss Lady. Go ahead. <clears throat> Let me tell you that Andres and Lady had a debate because they didn't know if they were going to talk about bodyguards or body works. <laughs> I don't know if you know the brand <laughs> Bath and Body Works. <laughs> so, body they works. decided to talk about bodyguards. Okay. The teacher I one take care of your life, and the other ones of take care of your skin. So. Exactly. That's a very good comparison. Uh huh. Go ahead. Okay. Well, I'm going to start, lady. So, now everyone, we are going to talk about of our service that is a body wars. That the name of our service is body is a uh, save your life. That is the name for brand. Okay. So, what does your product do? In our case, of course, we take care of the life of the different people or places, but we provide the service for any people or companies. That is the or product the the the, the thing of our product. So the other question is how much does your product cost? The price of our product is $700 per person. So you can multiplicate, and that is correct teacher if I say multiplicate. Yeah. Multiply, multiply. Multiply. So mm -hmm. if you, you can multiply, for example, if you want more than one body wars, so you have to multiply this quantity for the people that you need in your company or in your necessity. Mm -hmm. um, will you use any special price strategies? Yes, of course. For example, if you hire a contract with us today, you don't pay the all a month. You are going to have a discount of the 10%. So ladies going to follow with the other questions. Okay. Okay. Where will you sell your product? Make a with website page for customers can purchase or product. Where will you position your product to catch the aid of your target customer? Radio, TV, YouTube, TikTok, plus publicitary railings. How will you advertise the product? Visit different banks, government institu institutions, and companies to explain terms and conditions about service. Who is your target customer? Our target customer are government institutions, markets, stores, airports, banks, or important people like police, politicians or singers. Okay, excellent. Well, um, we, we were discussing about the last two questions, well, the last three questions, right? And how, for example, um, let me see this one, how will you advertise and where will you position your product? They can be similar because sometimes a uh, especially when you're talking about services, right? Uh, they are not something you can see or that you can put at a strategic place. But in this case, we're talking about um, similar to promotion, right? Like how will you promote or who will you promote it to that it becomes visible to, the, to your target customer? So um, these two questions may be a little similar in that sense. Okay, great job, Andres and Lady. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Um, well, 
I'm not making many corrections because uh, we made corrections, uh, well, at least with Lady and Andres uh, as they were working, right? Um, and I have been also checking uh, everybody's work uh, individually. Okay, let's see. Um, last but not least, Mr. Roberto and Mr. Rodrigo. Go ahead. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello, Rodrigo. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let me share the presentation. Can you see the image? Yes. Okay. Give me a second, please. Do we have any? Hello. Hi, we're, we're ready for you. Go ahead. Yes. Okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, okay. We're talking about the new product in, in the in the Salvador, mm -hmm. uh, the marketing plan is the following. Um, first, the phrase, um, the product is drink the essence of the lives, a taco coffee. Uh, number one, or oh, letter A, product service. Number one, you get to give the product a new, a new brand name. What name do you choose? The name is at a coffee. This okay. is the name of the new product. And the second question, what does your product do? It gives your an exquisite pleasure to your morning. Also, the energy to complete your goals. Wow. Mm -hmm. Then, then let, there, let there be price. Number three, how much does your product cost? It's seven dollar one pound. Is 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 cheaper. It's affordable for everyone. Okay. And number four, will you use any special price strategies, coupon sales, even etc.? If so, which strategies and why? Okay, the strategies to use is free sample. Why? Because it is the, the best way to let the customer taste the flavor. Mm -hmm. uh, give me a second, please. Now I ask a uh, putty. Okay. Uh, the the following is letter C is is the turn of the Rodrigo. Well, okay. in in this case, uh, for the placement, uh, we think the that we the we need to move the the our at a coffee on for in retail stores and in the online mode like marketplace and any other uh, places and uh, in the internet. Also, uh, we uh, we think it uh, to position our product in the, for example, in retail stores, in costume shops, in a strategy locations like uh, maybe near to the to the clerk in this case, or maybe uh, in a specific point when you uh, at the for the first view you have on the on the store. 
or maybe when you search if for a, a specific product, you can see the shelf with the, the with the coffee bags. And for ultimate, the the in the promotion, uh, the way to advertise the product, uh, we think it will be the social media, social media like Facebook, Instagram, maybe also TikTok. And, and we 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 need to create a a basic web page to promote the the, the Atta coffee. Also, other others channel the of the communications. Maybe we can pay or we can use a a space on radio, some programs of radio to to have a a I I don't know a. Uh, publicidad, publicity, and exactly. some publicity. Uh, publicity in some space of in the radio, and for ultimate, uh, what is who is uh, uh, our target customer? Well, our target customer is the people who wants to enjoy a cup of motivation. That's all. If you want, if you like to enjoy coffee, you can buy a economic coffee. If you want to enjoy a, at a coffee, it's because you, you search a motivation on your day. That's all. Okay, very good. How many neurons did you burn? <laughs> I think I think you got inspired with the coffee. Uh, oh. my, my, my wife uh, helped us. <laughs> ah, <laughs> so clap for your wife. Okay. Yes. <laughs> so everybody clap for Roberto, clap for Rodrigo, and also for Rodrigo's wife. Yes. <laughs> Thank credits. you. Actually, she's enjoying a cup of coffee. Ah, that's why she has it. She was. But she is not enjoying another coffee. That is different. Okay. <laughs> Good. Well, um, <laughs> Great, thank you for sharing. And uh, I hope that everybody uh, was able to check like the different strategies your classmates were using, right? Because some of you were talking about, for example, personal selling. Some of you were talking about indirect distribution. Some of you were talking about um, like selling online. Okay, so different strategies, different products. That is a, the beauty of diversity, right? You guys had different different things to discuss. Okay, well, it's almost time to go. So let me check attendance. Um, one second here. I think I'm having an issue with my... Google account. No, it's here. Okay, Danny Anthony, si buena aventura. Here, teacher. Gilberto Benito, Santa Maria Rios. Present, teacher. Jose Andres Martinez Pérez. Present, teacher. Julio Aristide, I'm sorry, I'm skipping. Jose Israel Martinez Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Eh, Julio Aristides Paz Rivas. Is a listener. A lady, Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. A Luis Rodrigo Morales Ortiz. I'm here. Okay, Maria Leticia Relegeño González. Thank you. A Mauricio de Jesús Buruca. I think he's a listener. A Rebecca Maria Cardona. She's a listener too. Roberto Carlos Cames Alvarenga. Present teacher. Roberto oh. <ríe> Rolando Danilo Sánchez Arteaga. Rolando, <ríe> were you here? I don't see you. Ah, yes, I see you as a listener. Okay, Sofía Karina Crespo Martínez, listener two, and Yesenia Gabriela Aguilar Granadeño, listener as well. Okay, everybody, thank you for participating. Have a wonderful night. And I'll see you. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Good night, everyone. Take care. Bye. Good night.